Good evening. It is midnight on September 22nd, and I just wanted to go over the state of my channel as of September. Uh, a few days ago I had my birthday. I am now 19 years old, which is pretty exciting. I get to learn how to be an adult all over again. <laughs> uh, I have started back up college, so uh, I have not been as available to do a lot of the things I want, but ironically I've had more time to record and upload lately. I've kind of just had to leave my recordings to upload while I'm away doing something. Now, uh, I started a series that I did not expect I was going to start. Um, Portal Reloaded had a multiplayer update that I did not know about at all. The cooperative update. And I have started playing with this person on it. And we have had a great time trying to figure out these puzzles. So this was a very unexpected thing that I did not expect I would be playing. And yet here I am playing the multiplayer of it. And we will be finishing the multiplayer of it this year as well, 2023. So I'll actually have my first series that I've finished, and I, I love it, especially because I am going into it completely blind. I have no idea what these puzzles are. I haven't watched gameplay of it. I did watch that level that we did cheese together. Somebody cheated in it, so I'm glad that at least we cheesed it, not cheated. It's kind of funny to think about. I hope that somebody finds the actual solution to that puzzle, if there is one, but whatever, it's all in the past now. Uh, as you can see, I definitely am a big fan of Portal. I have many of the games, including one that isn't even on Steam that I managed to get on here. However, um, I, I'm not ready to play them yet because, of course, I am playing the other games. I want to catch up on the other games real quick too. So we know that in Left 4 Dead I've beaten all the campaigns and I've started doing survival and I even uploaded a really cool time I did. I think I recorded another survival video that I need to upload. I think I, I, I don't know, I have to go back. This is why I'm very disorganized. I don't even remember if I did or not. But uh, now that I've shown off a few maps on survival, next up I want to use some commands to show what Versus is like. Actually, I might play it with the friend that plays on Portal Reloaded with me. I originally was just thinking of doing it single player with some commands, but now that he loves Left 4 Dead and he loves playing it with me, I'm thinking of just showing off Versus in Left 4 Dead 1. Once I do that, I'm going to play a few add-on campaigns, and I will officially consider Left 4 Dead in its infinite stage that I'm going to put it in, where I'll come back every now and then to do other stuff. But... Yeah, Left 4 Dead, we still haven't seen everything that Left 4 Dead has to offer. And naturally, once I'm done with Left 4 Dead, I will be moving on to Left 4 Dead 2. Plants vs. Zombies is something that I've also been working on. I think I did the nighttime levels, and I have to move on to the pool levels. Plants vs. Zombies is a special game, but it's not special in that it's anything new, really. I know a lot of people know what the game is. But there are still some achievements I have to hunt for. So, I will consider Plants vs. Zombies done once I beat the game. I, I'll play the mini. I'll come back and play the mini games every now and then. But I think I'd like to move on to something else once I beat the actual story. I have not considered what will be next. I think something fun and adorable like this. That that little inferno is something I can't wait to get to. And then finally, something that I've been ignoring, The Binding of Isaac. This game is wonderful. I don't know why I haven't been putting more time into it. I'm going to start doing that soon. I promise. Uh, it's a really fun game, and ever since I started recording myself playing it, I've actually gotten better at this version rather than Rebirth. So that is something I can't wait to go back to. Once I'm done with that, naturally I'm going to move on to Rebirth. And that game will take a long-ass time, so... Yep. In the meantime, I'm always adding new games to my list to play every now and then. Something else I can't wait to touch is Don't Starve. I bet I could get better at that game if I were forced myself to play it. 
And then there's also stuff like, I haven't even played or touched Phasmophobia, that's something I want to do. And I don't even just have games on my Steam here, there's other games that I have on, like, like, it, like downloaded games from uh, Game Jolt, Indie Games, anything like that. So I cannot wait to touch these games, uh, especially ones that I haven't played before. These, surprisingly, I have not played at all. I cannot wait to. They look like they're really funny. So yeah, um, that is an update on all the games and stuff that I'm going to do in the future. I have no idea how long it'll be before I actually beat these games. It could last until 2024. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, I do appreciate uh, some of the comments that I have gotten, though. Not a lot, but I uh, people are recognizing what I'm trying to do. And I'm glad that I get to reach out and meet new people. So with that all in mind, um, it's a little bit busier here on out for me. I cannot wait for October. Spooky month is coming up, and that's going to be a fun time. And I am doing everything I can to balance my life out right now. Things are going pretty well as of uh, this current day. I'm very happy with my life. And the things that I get to do with it. Although I will say I'm taking a coding class and I hate it. I hate coding so much. But uh, I, I'm I'm going to get over it. That's, that's what honestly is taking up so much of my time is coding. I'm going to come back to this and be like, yeah, I remember that. It's such a fucking pain in the ass. But uh, I hope that everybody enjoys the rest of their nights. Whoever's watching this. And you have a good rest of your night.